Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we are playing The Tenants Free Trial. Um, I don't really want to make the investment to buying the game, so that is why we're going to play the free trial and then we're just going to stop. Ow. No. But the game isn't out yet. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna have our landlord's name is Cheapskate, and we're clearly a vampire. Smoking indoors? That's an eviction. Alright, where will we buy our first property? Manhattan is off limits and so is the suburbs. I guess we're headed to the slums then. <laughs> Seems fitting since my guy's name is literally Cheapskate. Alright, what apartment looks like my style? Mm, these, but none are for sale. What about this one? I can say it has a great view of the donut. They're gonna think that's like some tourist attraction or something. <laughs> but no, it's just a donut on a roof. Wait, what? It costs 70 grand? Wait, Wait, I have to work to earn money? This is ridiculous. All right, I gotta get a job. I gotta go clean for Uncle Steve. But he'll give me four grand. All right, maybe Uncle Steve ain't so bad. We'll tolerate him at Thanksgiving, you know, despite his ramblings about aliens. Oh my God, Steve. <laughs> Where do we... What? Where are we? How do we even have four grand to spend if this is what you're living in? Ain't nothing gonna stop the two of us if we don't keep this up. I don't even know who you are. I'm cheapskate over here. It's just getting all the profit and you're the one doing all the work. If I've learned anything from The Sims, Jim Pickens has trapped someone in here and that is their piss. So let's clean that up first. I like how this fuse box here is literally right next to the shower. Just in case the power trips when you're in the shower so you can just quickly whoop, <laughs> and then get back to it. Oh, I broke their shower so I'm just gonna dispose of it, I guess. <laughs> it was a safety hazard, okay? And now it's up to code. He's hired me to clean and I disposed of his shower. Oh, wait, he actually wants floors fitted as well? He wants hardwood floors. Can I put that in the bathroom? Greek oak. There you go. Oh, you want the whole thing hardwood. Okay, the whole thing is Greek oak. And let's go with a strong mustard for the walls. <laughs> Uncle Steve loves mustard. It's literally all over himself all the time. All caught up in his beard, all over his hairy belly. He wanted blue. <laughs> I've just realized... God damn it. Okay, we're repainting. What a waste of paint. But at least we know deep down his house is filled with mustard. All right, we want to furnish it. Uh, preferred furniture. DVDs. I don't think DVDs are furniture. Oh, very similish down here. <laughs> oh my God, they actually do just look like The Sims. All right, where do I look for DVDs then? In decor or what? <laughs> I'm confused. I'm going to tell Uncle Steve to dream big. I'm going to get him a Christmas tree. I replaced your shower with a Christmas tree. It is the season. He's like, um, it's March. Yeah, but work hard, play hard. <laughs> there we go. I love a map of the world at ankle height. I'm just buying him loads of posters. I hope he's okay with that because he wanted DVDs, but I keep trying to tell him that DVDs are not a furniture. There we go. I was going for a nice variety, but then I just kind of gave up and went with smiley faces all over the wall. Oh, wait, he still wants the other stuff. Yeah, he actually needs a shower back. Well, we're going to have to have to stuff them in right now because I don't think there's much space for him, but we'll make it work. Just put it even closer to the electric cabinet. You know, it's a microwave. I'll just put that down by the shower too, I guess. You know, you can microwave up some nice food when you're in the shower or charge your iPhone, perhaps. This new property to market boasts a lot of unique features, but the biggest selling point is that toilet with a view. Look to your left, you see the sea. <laughs> Look to your right, you see the Johnsons <laughs> up in their own trailer. Now that's social distancing I can get behind. You want toilet paper? Naturally, we'll put that over here. <laughs> Wait, can I put it up up high? There we go. <laughs> if you're using the toilet, you gotta clamber up above the fridge to get the toilet paper. Can I be a landlord yet? I feel like I'm ready to own my own property now. TV in the shower? I think so. <laughs> Feckin' TV is in the way. All right, I guess you have to watch it from the shower at an angle like an animal. Feck's sake. You know what? I actually really like that they use the Sims 1 style. Like even the, the text, the font and everything looks really like it. I think that's really cute. I like it a lot. Here, have a lamp. My first official job. I think I made a loss. I spent so much money on the furniture. <laughs> I shouldn't have hung all those smiley faces. Wait. My aunt left me this unit? Oh, fantastic. Okay, I can become a landlord. I need to spend four grand connecting the electricity. Oh, sweet, but Jesus. Who was living in here before? They had a feckin' foosball table. Who has a foosball table, but no power in their house? Someone with their priorities in order, that's who. Okay, it's ready for rent. <laughs> okay, Uncle Steve gave me four stars, but really did not like the decor. I'm gonna need more money if I wanna give it heating. I mean, I don't need to give it heating. My house doesn't have heating. I'm not even lying. I've not had heating. 
overheating in a year. Please, God help me. My toes are frozen. What's the biggest paying job you got for me? All right, Luis, I'm going to speed run your job. <laughs> He's like, um, that doesn't sound very good, actually. I don't want it done fast. I want it done right. <laughs> oh, I just realized the house I have is on boring lane for feck's sake. Jesus, Luis, you've got a lovely apartment here. All right, speed run. What do you want? You want a fridge? Sure, throw in the fridge. Cooker, go for it. Kitchen sink? I hope that's for the kitchen sink. No, that's a bathroom sink. Okay, two sinks it is. There we go. Now you can wash each sink when they get dirty. That's very handy, actually. Very modern. Chair? <laughs> oh my god, it's falling apart. Tyler, hardwood? Done. I gave you both. Now you can't complain. Walls? Mustard. <laughs> oh god, they want yellow or blue. All right, throw in some blue as well so that they're both happy. You want a mirror? There you go. It's not even straight on the wall. <laughs> wall plant? Oh, fuck's sake, I've got this, but you're getting it now. You're getting a Christmas cheer, whether you like it or not. Wall plant. <laughs> Again, be careful when you're watering that thing. I just seem to love water and electricity for some reason. But how do you like it, Luis? <laughs> he's like, huh, this hides the fuse box really well. <laughs> oh, no, actually, he's like... Uh? In fact, everything he looks at, he's like, uh? What do you mean three stars? Rooms have very poor decor. Kitchen. I don't think you could call that room I made a kitchen. It has a bit of everything. Material's not uniform. God damn it. If you wanted to be so picky, Luis, then do it yourself. Just a simple bathroom remodel. This is easy, actually. They're like, why did you cram everything into this one corner? <laughs> I'm trying to create space, you know, an open plan. <laughs> they love it in Europe. <laughs> I've never been, and I've, I've never looked into it. I I would just assume. So cultured over there. I love the, the curtain door as well. Absolute just pieced out as it's the owns. I know you want tile, but I'm thinking carpet for the bathroom. What do you mean I can't accept it? What? Oh, come on. <laughs> it's good. It'll soak up all the water. Oh my god, that is the worst bathroom I have ever seen. It looks so like, it looks like it's attacking your eyes. I'm gonna have a sign saying work hard, play hard over the toilet. I'm not sure what that's even supposed to mean. And then I'm gonna have a clock <laughs> so that you can speed run peeing. Wall plant? Sure. <laughs> Jeez, it's, it's so overwhelming. Everything is in that that corner. There's nothing over here. I'm done. You can come in. Bus driver, move that bus. Work hard, play hard. Uh? <laughs> I think that should be all my reviews. Just, uh? I know this is questionable. Like, why is the toilet roll above the bath? But it's because if you roll a bit extra off, instead of it falling on the floor, it'll just go in the bath and it'll break down and go down your drain pipe. They love it in Europe. I would assume. Can I afford heating yet? <laughs> they love heating in Europe too. Do I have any jobs? It's the highest paying one. A pro gamer in need of bedroom renovation? I'm actually your man for once. Yeah, this is a pro gamer apartment, all right. Dream big, work hard, be brave, live, laugh, love. I just need a big sign in his room. If they have one saying, I don't need to get a life, I am a gamer. I have plenty of lives. Then we're talking. You are breathtaking. Right back at you, video game. Thank you. You boosted my confidence today. <laughs> it's a request. Single bed, TV, video game console, game, anime figure, wall lamp, game. <laughs> he wants me to pick out his game. All right. Where can I find anime figure? All right, here it is. Oh my god, it's huge. It's staring out the window. That's so scary. You can look up and think it's like a hostage stuck up here. Who gives you a choice of floors and says, I either want hardwood, exquisite flooring, or lino. Just throw anything down. Well, you're going to pay for that. <laughs> you should have been more specific. You should have just said hardwood. It's really hard to design his room when this anime figure is so big. That costs $1,800, by the way. I just thought I'd fill you in there. So that's where the majority of the budget has gone which is why he's sleeping on the floor. I mean, sure, having a proper bed is nice, but like, have you seen that anime figure? Pretty cool. Imagine phoning your landlord. I can't make this month's rent. I bought an anime figure. Devil armchair. <laughs> it says in brackets, gamer. I would actually love to buy him this, but he doesn't want a chair for some reason. I guess the anime figure was more important and he couldn't get everything. Big TV for video games. Oh God, that was nearly all my budget. Maybe I shouldn't buy that. <laughs> CRT it is. I mean, if it means I get to keep my anime figure, who cares? Apparently a pro gamer and I'm playing games on the floor on a CRT. Is a DVD player a console? <laughs> it's bringing me back to my retail days. Dealing with all the moms. Ah, oh, bless them. Right, I bought you this video game called Fighting Orange. I can only hope that it's a spin-off of the annoying orange. What is wrong with you, anime figure? Is the console in the way? Like, why does it need so much space next to it? What are you doing with it? Actually, don't, don't answer that question. Wow, the perfect gamer pad. Oh my god, he wants a microwave in there as well. How 
gamer can you get? It's really bad when your microwave looks better than your TV. I play video games on this thing. It probably is a smart microwave. I'm putting up a few mirrors because I want this person to realize that they still can change. This isn't good. The position they're in, you know? All right, we're done. <laughs> All right, time to find out what the gamer says. I'm so excited, honestly. I want to start a reality show where I just fix up gamers' rooms like this because I feel like it would be really easy. <laughs> Wait, what do you mean? Uh, yes, you love the, the, uh, the furry poster. I don't know what it actually is. Wait, what are you reviewing over here? I didn't do anything here. Okay, success. Fantastic. Four stars. It's worth every penny to see your flat rearranged in such a masterful way. Yes. They're complaining about the cheap TV. Look, if you want to spend $1,800 on a statue, I might have to cheap out in other areas, okay? It's not my fault. Can I afford heating yet? <laughs> I'm so cold. Here we go. Install heating. Uh, that that was it? Ra one radiator? That was six grand? I think I want to keep the foosball table. Like, I don't want to rent out a place with a foosball table. Foosball's cool. <laughs> all right, I'm going to rearrange this entirely. I'm building new walls and everything. I am going fecking all out on this. Oh, I forgot a bathroom. <laughs> oh, no, I forgot a bathroom. All right, I guess it's going in with the fuse box. <laughs> like, if you think about it. Do you actually need showers? Like, what do they even do? Like, I've seen them, but I've never actually used them. So, legit, what do they do? Nothing like that. A fully clothed shower in the morning to make you feel fresh. Oh no, I ran out of money. <laughs> That's still decent, right? <laughs> like, I put in a bit of effort. I was decorating it, and I got a fridge and uh, an open plan bathroom in here. I just ran out of money, is all. But, like, I'd live here. I'd be miserable, but I'd live there. Looks like you got it ready for renting. Y yep. <laughs> they love bare plasterboard in Europe. All right, open house. Okay, uh, Jesus, that was fast. She was just passing him an open house. All right. <laughs> Walk straight in. She loves the table, of all things. That table looks like it's ready to fall apart. It's missing paint and everything. You're earning. 80 grand a year? Oh, personality type gamer. I know how to cater to you. Let's begin negotiation. Uh, why are you all the way down here? All right, let's say two grand. 2020. Yes, okay, she accepted it. <laughs> She's like, I love 2020. <laughs> the only person on earth that does. Also, I have a camera in here, I guess, because I can just watch you while you sleep now. Okay. I feel like I took advantage of her stupidity. She's in there making plain noises. Sup, cheapskate. Better save my number. It comes across so aggressive, but that's just my name. Oh, there's an elite contract. This will pay me enough to finish my apartment. Oh my god, it's a boathouse. Is that treasure? Can I can I can I take that? Oh my god, something has happened in their apartment. Your tenant needs attention. What do you want? You've got roaches. That's kind of your fault. <laughs> Alright, he's on the way. <laughs> Oh my god, what have you been doing? The place is destroyed. Oh my god, why did I trust her? Feckin' gamers, like they're a disaster. Just spray it everywhere, all over the couch, it's fine. Thanks for helping me solve this problem. Just don't do it again, because I was joking when I put the blame on you, like saying it was your responsibility and all that. But honestly, that seems like an odd coincidence. You move in and the place is infested. I don't know if I'm decorating this room or I'm just loading it up with cargo. There we go, I just packed it full of stuff. And some things like this... I don't know how to put on like a desk. So I just threw them on the ground like the gramophone. This thing's a major health risk. Deliver job. Oh, there's the captain himself. I put the smiley face on. That's kind of my trademark, by the way. Ah, he loved it. Decor, no issue. Cheap materials were used. Category focused. Is that good? I don't, I don't know. When you're contacting someone called Cheapskate to renovate your apartment, you, gotta, you can only blame yourself. Like, sorry if cheap material was used, but it's literally in my name. Bills? What? Why do I have to pay their bills. They're renting from me. What the hell is that funky music? <laughs> what is it signifying? This is how all young people music sounds to me now. Just blah, blah, blah. Oh, cool. There's other things as well. Like this. I don't know what the hell this is. Noisy tenants who are giving me a headache need someone to take care of them. Like, do you want me to murder them? <laughs> God, no, Jesus. Just, just get them out of my apartment. <laughs> oh, no. You're causing more hassle. Oh, for feck's sake, there's hardly enough rooms for one of you, not a mind three of you. This person's parting in the hallway. <laughs> the door is stuck. Honestly, it might just be a zombie invasion based off the way they're moving. You've got feckin' zombies. This guy's eating out of the toilet. <laughs> and she forgot to pay her first rent. Remind politely. Oh, she actually paid. That is a surprise, honestly. I didn't think that was gonna happen. All right, Cindy, you better watch yourself. But I think we're gonna end it there. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know if you wanna see more. I'd be down to play more of this game. It seems very, very fun. Thank you so much for watching. Appreciate it. Subscribe if you're new and I hope to see you tomorrow. Bye for now.